What's going on, people of the interwebs? Explosion Flosion here, back again with the next episode of our Pokemon Sun Let's Play. Last episode, we kind of just made it through Route 2, and if you notice on the bottom screen there, it says we got a quest marker coming up right on us. We managed to... I thought that there was a good place to stop. We, we kind of just explored the route a little bit, finally caught a Drifblin, or Drifloon, and handed it over to the woman who gave us 10 grand, which was pretty nice. But now we're ready to just continue on. Let's find out what exactly we have here. Wait. Oh, there we go. Delibird? Oh, God. Delibird has, a whole, um, has hold of your bag and won't let go. It seems it wants to follow it into the berry fields. Something is going, something going on in the berry fields? Get in there. I may need my berry supply kept. Team Skull in here trying to steal some berries? Oh, I knew it. You got a lame bunch of berries, now Team Skull is your adversaries! Taking berries off your hands just the start of our plans, yo! Let's get figgy with it, watch all our nabs and berries. They're making too many puns, they need to stop. Like, we need to stop them literally just because they are a meme. And we are the meme lord. So we literally need to put them in check. I'll share my berries for free with any Pokemon, but you'll not get a single one from me. So what, I'm lower than a Pokemon? I already got self-esteem issues, man. Yo, they're actually, like, super fresh on- <laughs> I can't! I can't deal with this! And what are you looking at, huh? 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 Yo, hold up, yo! You got a bone to pick with us, homie? You and Cat may have us beat, but us at the- um, at the marina. But you won't be so lucky if we get serious, yo! I appreciate your concern, child, but these Team Skull Punks do nothing but talk. Big and, um, small, act small. You carry on with your island challenge, don't give them a moment's notice. Yo, we're standing right here, at least you act like a little bit afraid of us or something, you know? Yo, you trying to run away? We're gonna have to take your Pokemon along with the berries. Yo, check out how hard-headed Team Skull's grunts can be. Do I either find them both at the same time, or just one, one after the other? Go challenge by Team Skull Grunt. And sends in Drowsy. And he's just like, yo, we got this. See, so, I think I'll do the same, wow. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I hate misclicking! I can't wait to get rid of Growl. Pound. Oh wow! Predictions! Wait a minute! Now up that razor leaf real quick. Bye. Ah, oh, that was a crit too. Yeah, we just need a tackle. We don't need to do anything crazy. Alright, and Drowsy gone. Sumo Slammer grew to level 12. And we defeat Team Skull. Yo, I'm feeling mad annoyed at my team right now. Do we have to fight the other one now? Yo, for real? You best stop trying to act hard, kid. Yo, I'm so annoyed right now, homie. Let's go. I'll mess with Le um, Lima again. Oh, yeah, let's do it. Vernon Cavern is pretty close by anyway. And you? You better listen to what my, my boy says and drill into your thick skull of yours. For real. You better not forget, numb skull. Oh, you and that rallet there did quite the number on him. Allow me to thanks for driving off these Team Skull numbskulls. Awesome, Orin Berry. Orin Berries can restore some of your Pokemon's HP for them. You can feed a berry to a Pokemon or let one hold a berry and they'll eat it when needed. If you're looking for more berries, you won't have to look very hard. <laughs> I'm done with this game. Berries grow like, well, like weeds here in Alola, so feel free to pick up any you find. Enough with those helping folks out pinches. Let's go do the trial at last, kiddo. I know what you mean, but let's see. Let's just grab all these berries really quick. I wonder then, like, do berries just fall down everywhere around here and I just can literally keep cooking them up? Aha! Silver powder! Sorry, Rotom, I need you to keep exploring. There's so many free items around. Is this the plant berries, or is this just for him? 
Yeah, I guess it's just for him. I, or maybe we can come back and do something with this later? Wait, was there an item underneath? No, I thought there was an item underneath that. Or maybe there is and we just have to go around to the front? No, that's not anything. Okay. But there's an item over here. And a big mushroom. Alright, continuing on. Alright, so the thing that this is his farm, I doubt I have to actually really do anything. Like, in his house. Alright, back on to Route 2. What is this? Trainer tips. Try taking another person's Pokemon it makes you no different than a thief. Pokeballs only use- yeah, we know how- we know that we can't catch other people's Pokemon. Oh yeah, you're a trainer. Sounds like something is... There is. Is it a Makuhita over here as well, or is it just in that one patch that there'll be always a Makuhita? Oh, it's a Young Goose. So yeah, that patch has Makuhitas, this patch is Young Goose. Mm, we'll try it, I don't know how much more. And Pursuit. Rally take a step back. Oh, we actually went up and did it. Alright. It's not enough to level up. Alright, so we really only want to do the trainer battles right now. Well, lucky for us, there's a trainer right over here. <laughs> Why did he turn around so quick? Oh, what do you think? I'm getting pretty good at greetings, huh? I'm also great at Pokemon battles. Watch me be better, though. I'm a child. You're an adult. Like, backpacking around the world. Backpacker Ashley. What you got, though, Ashley? Cottony? Oh, I love Cottony. I love Wisp Cot. Fairy win. Get out here with that. Alright, so then Peck goes through. Is that gonna one-shot? Nope. Still not enough. I need slightly stronger moves on Rallet. Like, I feel like Rallet has the power to do these things, just not the right moves. Maybe the, I'll have a power compensation when I evolve. Which will hopefully be after this battle. Are you kidding me? I still didn't level up? Oh my. Level 12. Ouch. Yeah, get knocked down, kid. Alright, let's keep going. I want to do this island challenge. Oh, but there's always still more to explore. Oh, you do battle me. Hey, let's battle. Straight into the point. I love it. Blast Isabella. What do you have, Blast Isabella? Mistrevis. Alright. No, I don't want to click on you. I want to click on fight. I want to razor leaf you real quick. Psy wave. Oh, that might hurt a bit. Eh, it's okay damage. Nothing Rallet can't handle. Rally, come on. Eat it. And done. Alright. Oliver, you now reach level 16. Do you evolve at this level? Defeated last Isabella. She's whining and complaining. You don't evolve at level 16? Oh, come on. And another super potion. Alright, well. Oh, look, it's how. How's the Flosion your Pokemon doing alright? Yeah, I'm fine. I know my team's been se seeing better days, that's for sure. Come on, Flosion, let's stop by the PMC. I've never heard them actually abbreviate it. You know, a Verdon ca um, Cavern place, right? I guess it's kind of like the sake, like sake of the Tapu Koko. You ain't even allowed to go in unless you're on the island challenge. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I have something you're pretty amazing to share with you, Flotion, you lucky thing. Oh man, three revives, let's go. 
Their vibes are items sold to have. Are solid items to have. If your Pokemon faints in battle and can't go on, you know what a revive does. Pokemon sometimes sell different things, but that's just that. The two clerks on the counter even sell different things from one another. I think I'll treat myself to the cafe. Yo, this guy's always got food as like top priority. It's fine to take on that Lima character. I'm tingling with excitement or just electricity. Thank you, Rotom. All right. Now what do all the other people have to say here? Whether I'm sleeping or uh, my Oricoco comes at some point and falls asleep on my tummy. Aw. Have you ever- have you got a moment? You live here in Alola, right? I have a favorite ask. Do you mind? No problem. Wow, thank you. I'm so glad you would t listen to a request from a total stranger like me. I'm actually here in Alola. My darling hubby is on our honeymoon. He saw this Pokemon called Cutie Fly on Route 3, and it seems that my hus hubby really is totally smitten with it, and we don't have a them back home, see? He said it was too cute for words, with a yellow body and long pointy proboscis. Anyway, I wanted to know if you could catch one of those Cutie Fly for me. I know what kind of Pokemon it is, and I can probably go catch one myself. Like I said, I think they're somewhere on Route 3. If you catch one and come back, I'll show you- Show me this Pokedex entry, I can pay you for your trouble. So they literally just give you, like, cash side quests. Give Pokemon a Holdberry, it can use it. Hello, you're a Pokemon trainer, are you? Have you caught a Spearow? Will you trade it for my Machop? I have not caught a Spearow. See, you changing your mind, please let me know. What do you sell? Oh, heal balls, nest balls, luxury balls. Alright, I'm actually- do you sell great balls yet? Nope, still not yet. Alright, let's keep going then. Do you give me anything? Yes, thank you, Corsola. Boy, if only the water was on the sea were soda pop, then I could heal my Pokemon. If Pokemon's move lands as a critical hit, it will deal 50% more damage. Alright, so I guess the island challenge is back down that way, but for right here, I'm gonna start snagging all these berries, because you've gotta keep grabbing those berries. Chesto, Lepa, and another Chesto. Was it in here? No, it was up here. You! Greetings, Captain Lima here. Now my trial begins mere steps here from here in Verdant Cave. Note that the Pokemon living in Verdant Cavern are quite fierce. I wouldn't venture unless you're prepared for some potions and so forth. Through attempting the trial, um, the trials during the island challenge, only can one can only exceed her own limits, and that is what the Alolan people believe. Once you enter the Verdant Cave, you will be able to not be able to leave until you've completed the trial. Are you prepared for the trial? Yes. I'll be waiting for you. Alright, let's go in and do this. Actually, that, that's a perfect thumbnail right there. So we will actually, you know, stand there for a quick sec, give myself a little second. And we're good. Ooh, the music! It's a jungle in here. What Pokemon appear in here? Let me formally welcome you to the Verdant Cavern. I am your captain, Lima. Allow me to explain the basics of my trial. What should you attempt to do this? So young defeat three of the Pokemon that lurk here in their dens. Then reach the pedestal deep within the cave and collect the Z crystal there. You'll need to completely sit in sync with your Pokemon to succeed. Something sounds angry out there. Oh dear, and there's one more thing I forgot to mention. A TM? Many strong Pokemon make their home in this cave, but one stronger and more fearsome than the rest, this is known as a totem Pokemon, also resides there. It will be the greatest obstacle you face as you attempt to clear my trial. By the way, until you clear the trial, you will not be able to catch Pokemon in Verdant Cave. Aw, oh, are you kidding me? This is one of the seven trials you will face during your island challenge. And it begins now, the trial of Captain Lima. Alright, so I have to jump down apparently to get that right. Even though it's within arm's reach up top. There's a small den, will you look inside? 
No me. What? They can't speak. All right, a young goose appears. Go, Oliver. Raise your leaf. Actually, you know what? As much as I would like Oliver to kind of gain some experience here, I might want to actually run with Sumo Slammer. Just because he will actually be the fighting type to fight these normals. Cold Stone goes to 13. Sludge Puppy to 12. Must learn Disable. Nah, you're good with what you have. That's one down. Two more Pokemon to defeat. All right, there we go. Sumo Slammer up top will be fine. Oh, an item though. Another super potion. Can I go down? No, I can't go down. Well, wait, what is this? Is this another Pokemon to defeat? Alright, let's try this arm thrust. It's one. Two. And three destroyed. And Sumo Slammer is going to go to level 13. Let's learn Force Palm. Oh, heck yeah! How much damage does that do? 60? Take out attack. Mmm. Yeah, take a tackle. All right. Does that count as one, though? That did. Yep, still one more Pokemon to defeat. This isn't so bad. Nothing inside. Well, first off, I want that TM. I hate this game. Uh, let's just walk. And we got Brick Break. That's fantastic. Alright. Who's that up there? Maybe I have to catch another poke. Oh. I have to go up and around the other way? Alright, so let's see. When I went in there, I checked. How do I get over there, though? Oh! Oh, come on. Yo, yo, yo! It's your very thief boys back, back, back again, remember us? Sure I do. Whoa, even though we look identical, that's pretty impressive, actually. Who cares about that anyway? We're here to mess his trial up, yo! Oh, yeah, that's right. Let's go. Let's get that Pokemon, homie. He ran down the hill to cross up on me. Where's this other guy that literally is watching a child get assaulted by thugs? You are challenged by Team Skullgrim, but is he A or B? Sends out Drowsy. Oh, of course, Sumo Slammer is still out front. Actually, you know what, still? I'm gonna fake you out. Decent amount of damage. Alright. Now I'll actually go out then into Sludge Puppy. Right. 
tanky. Eat this bite. I'm gonna take a bite out of crime real quick. What has this game done to me? I mean, I'm even coming up with the worst puns for this. Mail call, go to level 12. Once learn mist, you will not learn mist. I said no. Keep old moves. Team Skull Grunt. Is it cool for me to be in Team Skull if I'm this brittle? What's up with that? For real though, I can't get my skull around it. This kid's mad strong, yo. Not even like that. This kid's straight up dangerous, homie. I don't know, man. Is the whole place trouble? Yeah, it totally is, homie. I mean, that thing is way strong than regular Pokemon. I don't even want to come out to battle. Yo, kid, you know what's the mad strong Pokemon lurking back here somewhere, right? I'd run if I were you. Nah, we're not even going out like that. We ain't even got a revenge. Go stand over in that den and catch that skulking young goose, yo. For real? Fine. I, I got no bones to pick with you. But they swear to God, they run up in my face again. Watch the other one standing over there, too. Yep, okay. Which means we just gotta run up top here. Alright, now he's mad because of the other two. Alright. A gumshoes? That's first gumshoes, then. That's not the totem, either. What about force palm? What happens if I force palm him? Catch these literal hands. Alright, arm thrust will be all I need to take him out. Fantastic. Alright, and that's the main portion of the trial done. And Sumo Slammer goes to level 14. Do you have like a really easy level curve? Is that it? Are Pokemon that are caught on the, um... Or do just these trial Pokemon give a lot of XP? You feed all the Pokemon. Alright, run up top. This guy better let me through now. Fantastic, you've proven your strength to all three Pokemon. Go right ahead, trials outside. Now to the heart of the cave, it's finally time to get your mitts on the first Z crystal. Also, I get I get to keep them after all these things? You feel a piercing gaze that seems to cut right through you, but from where? Will you take the Z crystal from the pedestal? Yes. Oh, maybe I can't until after I... How do I feel the piercing gaze? He's not even looking- <gasps> A TM! Gumshoes, the totem Pokemon of the Verdant Cave has appeared. Alright, what will he do? You're challenged by totem Gumshoes. Its defense rises. Ah, great. Makuhita's gonna have a hard enough time with this already. Uh, let's fake him out first. Alright, and then there's a the little young goose. Alright, let's hit Gumshoes though really quick. Alright, come on, we got this. One. Two, three. Ah, oh, only three times? Up, oh, lower my speed even more. Hmm. Oh, they're setting up hard. But at that range, I think a force bomb might be able to take Gumshoes out. Yep, 
this is really interesting though, just like how all of this actually comes into play, like just that this feels like a completely different kind of game with Pokemon. Oof. It still wasn't enough. I I won't be able to lift two attacks. Or oh, I don't even know if I'll be able to lift that one. Come on, Makuhita. Yes. Three oh four. Cold Stone goes level 14, Superfly goes level 13, and wants to learn Light Screen, but not right now. Sludge Puppy goes to 13. Yeah, all he has to do is one attack and I'm done. Actually, no, no, we're gonna go for a Super Potion. Alright, that's gonna two shot me, which it is. No, Pokemon, we need to switch it. Sludge Puppy can finish this up. Oof! Why is it so strong? Wait a minute. It's still- oh, but I flinched it. And... did I outspeed? Yeah, I do outspeed. Alright, and that is our first trial, ladies and gentlemen. Gumshoes disappeared back into the cave somewhere. What an incredible trainer you are! For you to be able to defeat the totem Pokemon that I had trained up for such a powerful state. I don't know what I can say. Working in harmony with your Pokemon, you have cleared the Triad of Lima. You are a phenomenal trainer. Congratulations, Flosion. The Z-Crystal from the pedestal is now yours. Oh, it's a blue crystal? Wait. You obtain Normalium Z. You now open up the Z Crystal's pocket and put the Normalium Z away. What you've just received is a normal Z Crystal. It's known as Normalium Z. Now, if you let a Pokemon that can use a normal type move hold that, you know, and strike an elegant pose like this one, then you'll become able to unleash a normal type move by unleashing its Z power. Moving right along. Ah yes, first thing is one thing I forgot to mention. The totem Pokemon. Every locale where a capital hold captain holds his or her trials, you will encounter a particularly strong Pokemon like Gumshoes just now. And during the battles against such Pokemon, they may summon allies to shore up their offense. It's not a tactic often seen in other regions. Perhaps Pokemon in Alola are simply more inclined to help one another. Since you have managed to defeat the totem Pokemon and prove yourself, you can now try and catch any of the Pokemon you find here in this cave. In fact, have some great balls. They just give everything away here, like, I swear. And here, let me see your Pokemon are healed up after all their hard work. We're done here. You can have something interesting I'd like to show you. Come with me on to Route 3. Alright, well, I just kind of want to grab that TM real quick. If you want to see more than just the Dreamboat Lima, he's waiting for you. What? That's a bit weird, Rotom. Alright. Well, first and foremost, though, because apparently we can't get up there just yet, we're gonna save it right there. So, we finally did it. Four actual hours of gameplay, and I've been on here for much longer than that, but... So I'd like to thank you guys all for watching, hope you enjoy. Next time we're gonna go see what Lima has us in store for us out on Route 3. But until then, listen to these calming jungle beats, go with the flow, and I'll catch you guys next time.